this is my review of the Jim Thompson Museum in Bangkok. If you get off the Racha TV, I think that's how you pronounce it, MRT station, you walk over the bridge, halfway through the bridge, there's a staircase leading downstairs towards the canal. Go down, walk towards the sign. I think this was 200 baht. You can't really tell from the videos, but the ponds are very deep and the fish are very well looked after. If you go through the gift shop, they have a silk mini museum. This is about some of the material that he used. It's free to go in. Depending on the time you arrive you will have to wait for a tour you can only go in the housing bit with the tour guide they have tours i think it was in english german and french so you have to wait until the next group timing can start but you're free to walk around the grounds like this this is also all the free part there is a cafe while you wait i do wish they had the timings online because i ended up wasting two hours just waiting around for my tour to start you have to take your shoes off to go upstairs in the housing area these are all of his artifacts this is a sign he got made but it says UAS rather than USA. The manufacturers made a mistake. You can't walk around the living area, you just walk from the side of it. I think it was really cool to learn about the history of him incorporated with Thai history as well. So it's definitely worth it. During the tour, they told us our ticket also gives us free entry to the exhibition center that his estate funds. It's only a five minute walk. Altogether, it takes about 30 minutes to get there and get back to the museum. I wish they told us this when we bought the ticket. You don't waste time waiting around for your tour to start.